Welcome to the July 4th edition of JTTV. This week's update is sponsored by Shepherd Pratt Health System. With Israel in mourning, hear local reactions to the discovery of the three kidnapped Israeli teens whose bodies were found earlier this week. Our prayers go out to all of the families. In local news, did you know that Meals on Wheels doesn't just supply delicious kosher meals? Their volunteers deliver companionship, care, and camaraderie as well. Maybe you'd like to volunteer too. Good news for the 14 agencies that receive funding from the Associated Jewish Community Federation of Baltimore. This year they raised $30 million in their annual campaign. And in more good financial news for the community, the newly named Pearlstone Campus for Living Judaism announced $2 million in capital improvements that include an on-site staff community village and other facility enhancements. Meet Toby Blumenthal, who has the enviable job of booking shows at the Meyerhof, including some of his favorite musicians and comedians. And did you know that Atman's isn't only about corned beef? They've held a local paper supply company for generations, too. Read this week's JT to find out more. And finally, do you know the history behind Baltimore's monumental past? Our cover story this week delves into the story of the Mount Vernon Place and Washington Monument restoration plans. Read it and check out the view from the top. Candle lighting is at 8.19 p.m. Shabbat Shalom from your Baltimore Jewish Times.